Hello, my name is Leo Lighter. Welcome you back to this video where we're going to take a look at adding particles to our mesh here. So what do I mean by particles? What I mean is that Substance has the ability to simulate particles along the surface of your model in order to add texture information. Now, let's go ahead and get started with that. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and create a new layer. Now, notice this time how I'm actually creating a layer and not a fill layer. So I'm going to create this and I'm going to call this particles. When that done, we can go ahead and we can select the brush in which we'd like to use. So we can go over to this uh, tab over here, choose particles, and we can go ahead and choose the particles we'd like. I'm going to go ahead and choose this one. And once we've done that, we can go under the particle system over here and we can play around with these values. So if you want to, you can have a look at all these options and see exactly what you get. In my particular case, I'm just going to go ahead and play around with the, let's see, speed and life and just see what we get here. So if I decrease this life, get a shot. if I increase it, you can see I get something like that. So we're just really sort of looking for somewhere between the values we'd like. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, let's see, I'm going to decrease this a little bit. And so I think that's going to be okay. Again, you can go ahead and look at these values and play around with them more. But for the purpose of this tutorial, what you need to know is that you can go ahead and change the physics of the particles. And then you can also go ahead and you can change the color. So if you'd like to use um, a different color, you can go ahead and do that. I'm just going to keep this pretty dark, somewhere close to this blackish or blue color. And we can go ahead and then start to paint. So all we have to do is go over to our model and then left click and you see we'll start to add these particles along the bottom so i'm just going to quickly go ahead and do this i'm not going to go too much in detail uh i don't really particularly think that this mesh is um suited for this type of um effect but i guess it really just comes down to an artistic choice and really sort of depends on what it is you're looking to achieve so i'm just going to go ahead and quickly add these to the areas underneath or where the crevices meet so let's just go ahead and quickly do that and so you can see what this is actually doing. So for now, this is the very basics of using um, the particle systems inside Substance Painter. I'd like to thank you for watching. And until next time, until the next video, bye bye for now.